We knew that we were going to have like a pretty like good team. We had McKenna Eisenberg and me pitching, but my like personal life kind of got in the way a lot. Back on Halloween of 2012, Corona Del Sol softball senior Mackenzie Bates learned her father Joe had been diagnosed with lung cancer. I mean, we spent countless hours together just practicing um, outside of like regular practice um, with the team and we were always together. <laughs> she was just real distant. Mackenzie was real distant, got a little more quiet, um, a little more urgency just to get home versus a couple extra ground balls. Me and him were really close. He was like my best friend on and off the field. I started playing when I was five and he was my coach all the way through. Back on April 24th, 2013, just before the softball state playoffs, Joe passed away after the cancer spread from his lungs to the rest of his body. It was always our thing and I no longer had someone to catch for me when I was practicing outside of team practice and I, I needed him there and I just lost softball. Mackenzie then decided to take a break from softball for her school and club team and proceeded to separate herself from the game for nine months. And they were all like so disappointed that I wasn't playing and I know that like I shut Coach Ray out. I know that for a fact. Wanting her back on the field, just wanting her back in my life, just said hey see you at practice, see you at the game. And she said I don't know if I'm going to play anymore. But Mackenzie would find strength in herself that she didn't even know she had. Just one week before softball tryouts this past Super Bowl Sunday, she texted Coach Ray and said she wanted to meet with her the next day. I decided that I needed to play and I needed to do it for myself and to feel closer to my dad. She comes in my office that day, that, that next Monday, with a blue and yellow card, which is the permission with physically and everything saying, here you go, coach, I'm trying out. You know, of course I started crying. <laughs> I found the strength from my dad to be out here. And it's, it sucks without him here sometimes. But there's other times when I can like feel his presence here and I know that he's so proud. That presence she feels has helped thrust her into an important role on a young Corona softball team. And every game she has her dad coaching her in the back of her mind. Play your hardest, do your best. Remember, like, keep your arms straight when you're pitching. and turn your hand out on your rise ball and it was always just really like constructive criticism but it was so helpful and I miss it. <laughs>